Gus Craig Award was established by the Salvation Army to help memorialize an incredible man whom we all love so dearly to help recognize the contributions by an individual that makes St. Augustine the unique place that it is. Well, one of the things that impresses me most about Christine is just her drive and her focus. You really see that her work in this community is about that deep, deep need to change things for the better, and that, that to me is the most beautiful trait of all. But her enthusiasm for whatever she undertakes just makes you want to join in and help in any way you can. As beautiful as I think Christine is inside and out, she is much more than a pretty face because she also always has a flawless pedicure, which is something I really admire. Christine started court reporting school with me until she found out that court reporters are silent and <laughs> she couldn't ask any questions or <laughs> do any talking, so that was not for her. Christine never runs out of things to say, especially if we're in a debate of any kind. Christine is a woman of many talents. She's charmingly persuasive. And she was one of those people that really made me believe that the Children's Museum was a project that was possible. Well, I knew Christine um, originally through the Junior Service League, and then she served as the board president for KidsBridge. Uh, you know, Christine Chapman is a wonderful partner with the city of St. Augustine, especially as we move toward our 450th. Christine started organizing things in St. Augustine early on. I was invited to her school's prom, and I was told we were meeting up at her house. They said, we're going to meet up there, we're going to give her all of our money. She's already taken all the arrangements in her own hands. She got the limousine, she scheduled the restaurant and our dinner out of town. And I remember thinking, she sounds a little bossy. Uh, once she uh, latches on to a project, it's going to be successful, and uh, anyone who's been around her for any period of time can figure out that uh, she makes things happen. Well, not only was she bossy, she was the most organized person I had ever seen in my life. The thing that's always and probably impressed me the most about Christine is the capability to get almost anything done. Uh, a very good example would be the Limelight Theater annual gala where we have expanded it uh, with Christine's help uh, to be the uh, single annual fundraiser that we need for the theater. When an assignment would come up that needed to be done, I was hoping that Christine would raise her hand because when she did, I knew I could forget about it. She's a doer. John Maxwell tells us that leadership is not about titles or positions or flowcharts. Leadership is about one life influencing another. It turns out she didn't even have a curfew. She was like on this honor system with her parents, something I'd never heard of. And my parents knew better than to give me that kind of a, you know. Christine has so much humor that maybe everybody doesn't get to see her kind of silly side, but she really does have a silly side and it's, uh, it's lots of fun. We have laughed and laughed and laughed. Honestly, she's been like a big sister to me. Gosh, I think my favorite story about Christine. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh gosh, I don't know that I should share that. I can't say. Not one that I'm allowed to tell. <laughs> Living with Christine is uh, interesting to say the least and uh, I have to be on my A-game all the time. What connected us was my wife and I talking to her and Steve about some things we could do together, the record and All-American Air partnering, and we uh, had this crazy idea to start a ping pong tournament. One of the things that Christine and I are involved in, and especially her and the foundation, the All-American Air Charitable Foundation, is the ping pong tournament. Boy, the, the, the ping pong talent in that room is just... It's a very competitive tournament, and it's a huge amount of fun for everyone. The All-American Air Charitable Foundation, through its main fundraiser, the All-American Air Table Tennis Classic, has raised more than $300,000 for charities in our community. 
Steve just couldn't get Christine out of his mind. But I asked her out for a whole summer, you know, and she finally went out with me. Here we are, 20 years later, <laughs> and here's Steve and Christine. Yeah, and she said, I didn't know you were so nice. <laughs> Christine has this habit of making suggestions to Steve, <laughs> and it always seems to work. Her, her suggestions are done in such a way that Steve thinks that he thought of it. <laughs> and uh, there's never a dull moment. Um, they have a great partnership, and they both know who the boss is. You know, uh, I had the pleasure of knowing Gus Craig for many, many years, and uh, you know, Gus Craig, uh, had he got to know Christine really well, would have counted her as one of his special people too. Gus would be so honored that Christine has just had her hand in so many wonderful things that have happened with this community. Well, I, I think about the folks in the past that, I've, that have won this award, and Christine um, fits right into that. The world definitely needs people like Christine Chapman. Uh, I think so many projects in, this, in our community get started because of the passion of one or two people. Christine has a passion for people. She's always aware of people's needs, of um, you just maybe don't think she's listening sometime because she's doing something else and then she heard every word you said and she follows up on it. But she cares about getting involved in things that make a difference to her community and that make a difference in people's lives. Christine, you know this is making me crazy. You're probably in shock, but that's how special you are to me. Christine, you know I love you, but I really do, and I, I'm so proud of you. I love you so much. When I have issues or when I've had great things happen to me, uh, she's one of the first people I want to share with because I know how much she, that kind of thing means to her. She loves our community. She loves her family. When it comes to my children, she is second mom. She's not just an aunt. She's the second mom. She steps in whenever, wherever is needed. There is just as no limit for the amount of love that Christine has for her nieces and nephews. So I'm proud of my sister for receiving this award because of all the hard work and all of the time and effort that she puts in to give back to her community. I can't tell you how much I love you and you're the best thing that ever happened to me. Christine, there are only three women that I would do this for. My mother, Alicia, and you. This, this, this. Christine, congratulations on receiving the Gus Craig Award. Everything that you do for our community is so amazing. Christine, I am so proud of you and so honored to be part of your night tonight. Congratulations, I mean, what an honor. Uh, couldn't have gone to a better person. The Gus Craig Award is all about what you've done um, for others and you have such a servant's mentality. We are so proud of you and I send you my deepest congratulations from the bottom of my heart. Please accept my heartiest congratulations on your receiving the Gus Craig Award. Christine, Christine we, we love, love you, you girl. girl. I am proud to be your friend and I congratulate you on this honor and there's nobody more deserving than you to get this award. The compassion that Christine has for the projects that are closest to her heart is something that, that really stands out to me. Christine, I know you were a little worried about receiving this award tonight, mostly because you're very humble, but you can stop worrying. You see, the Salvation Army's motto is in fact just like you. It's short, but powerful commanding but also compassionate, straightforward yet humble, businesslike but kind. Their short four-word mission statement is simply, do the most good. And lucky for us in St. Augustine, that's exactly what you've chosen to do with your life. 
congratulations on receiving a greatly deserved award.